Hi there! Today I will be showing you the mix skin I did which is inspired by the Pioneer gear like the XDJ or X2 and the XDJ XZ. I made this because there wasn't a very good mix skin in low resolution available yet and I tried to make it as scalable as possible. Let's check it out! So the skin I've created is especially aimed for uh, low resolution devices. So uh, it's fully scalable, but uh, it's optimized for as small as uh, 480 times 360 from the top of my head. Uh, well, it gives you some quirks because of this, because, uh, well, there's not a lot of uh, space to work with, but it's not too big of an issue because uh, I've implemented this show height feature, so you can look for tracks and folders separately. You can just drag and drop them there or if you're using a controller you can just press the load A, load B or load to deck buttons. Um, let's see, let's load two tracks. <laughs> and you can see it's scaling along just fine. In this case I'm using uh, blue waveforms but uh, RGB is just supported as well. As you can see it's working nicely, uh, Betafix still needs some work but it's there. Uh, browsing we've been into, uh, oh and there's the sampler. Nothing too fancy yet, but it works. So this is how it looks on an actual DDJ400 with the Raspberry Pi connected. Just three tabs, overview, browse and samplers. The browse still has two views for respectively the files and the folder view. We still need to optimize those, but well, that will come later, I guess. Let's see. So, here are the tricks which can be loaded by using your controller or just drag and drop them to their respective waveform. In the overview, there's more of a part which works just like intended. If you prefer RGB waveforms, you can just switch them in the settings so you will have full featured RGB waveforms. The sampler is still quite of simple as of now. They correspond with the paths below the decks. Nothing too fancy there, but it should work as intended. Those can be loaded by uh, pressing an empty slot or by emptying them and putting a new one. So that's basically it. If you want to download it, it's available on my GitHub page, uh, which is located at github.com slash timewasterinl slash pioneered, on which there's a neat little infos.